The moment I had the idea was probably three, four or five years ago, but it was just an idea. I was thinking about what was missing from New Zealand cider. It didn't have that farmhouse traditional style you get in England or Northern France. I realized I needed to get into gear and get the, the business going because I, um, I, I over-exaggerated the idea of the brewery to a girl I was trying to go out with. Um, and then she started going out with me, and so the story of the brewery had to become an actual brewery. From my experience with cider, um, it's something in its own right, and I wanted to introduce a bit of that into New Zealand. We've done a lot of experimentation with the kind of presses we use and the kind of methods we use to pulp the apples beforehand and how long we ferment for and how we ferment and how we carbonate. So we've made a really nice, slightly more buttery, slightly fresher one to replace our standard. And then we've made our funky farmhouse cider more funky farmhouse. We're gonna have a, a pine and maple cider come out for Birvana. For me, I'd say it's the whole process. Using local apples and really being with the procedure of it the whole way through. That's where sort of the fun is, it's, it's kind of fighting. Fighting it to get the product you want is why it's fun for me.